We are in Lesson 9 today in Ray's Arithmetic, and we're going to pick up where we left off, doing a little adding and subtracting with some cherries, and we've got eight cherries here. And I'm going to add another one to the group, so we've got eight. What happens when we add one to those eight? How many do we end up with? we got eight and one, so how many is that now? Is that nine? All right. How about if we have seven and two. How many are seven and two? Well, seven and two are nine. How about six and three? Are six and three nine? Yeah, they are. About five and four. Do five and four make nine? They definitely do. About four and five. Four and five make nine. How about three and six? Three and six make nine? Yeah, they sure do. How about two and seven? Two and seven make nine, don't they? Just like one and eight. We're back to where we started. One and eight. All right. Well, let's see. How about we start with our 10? Excuse me, start with our 9. And we take away 1. How many do we have? 9 take away 1 is 8. How about 9 take away 2? How many is that? 9 take away 2 is 7. How about 9 take away 3? 9 and we take away 3, we are left with 6. How about 9 and we take away 4? 9 and we take away 4 leaves 5. Alright, put our 9 back. How about 9 take away 5? That leaves four. How about nine and if you take away six? Nine and we take away six leaves three. Hmm, how about nine and we take away seven? Nine and we take away seven leaves two. Okay. Well, 9 and take away, if we take away 8 of those 9, how many are we left with? We have 1, don't we? Okay. Now, let's see, with this 9, what else can we do? How many 1's are in 9? So let's say each one of these is 1. How many of these 1's are there in 9? Well, there are 9, aren't there? Okay, how about, how many 3's are in 9? Let's say that's three, that's three, and this is three. So how many of that all together? One, two, three, that's three threes, isn't it? That's like three times three is nine. All right. Okay, let's do a little more. So we got our nine cherries here. How about we add another one? We have nine and we add one right there. They'd stop wobbling around. So nine, now we have one more which makes what? Ten? I see ten cherries, alright. How about eight and two? How many cherries is that? Is that ten? How about seven and three? How many are seven and three? Well, that's still 10. How about 6 and 4? 6 here, 4 here, you add them up and it makes how many? It makes 10. How about 5 and 5? Five? Do 5 and 5 make 10? Boy, they definitely do. 4 and 6. How many are 4 and 6? 
Well, that's still a 10. How about 3 and 7? 3 and 7 are 10. How about 2 and 8? 2 and 8 make 10. And how about 1 and 9? 1 and 9 also make 10. Let's see what else we can do here. How many, well, how many 1s are in 10? We spread these out a little bit. How many do you see? We have, each of these is 1. How many 1s are in 10? 10 1s in 10. How about 2s? Let's find out how many 2s we can make up 10. Let's see, put these guys over here, see how they're paired up. So each of these is two. So we've got one, two, three, four, five. So there are five twos in ten. So two times five is ten. How about we do this? How many fives? Let's say we divide these guys in half, these ten into two groups of five. So we got five here. 5 here. So how many 5's are in 10? 2 5's in 10. 5 times 2 is 10. How about that, huh? Alright. So 10... Let's see. How about we take away one of these 10? What are we going to end up with? 10 take away 1 is 9, right. How about 10 take away 2? 10 take away 2 is 8. Let's do 10 and we take away 3. That leaves how many? 7? Yep, that's 7. How about 10 and we take away 4? That leaves us with how many? 6? All right. How about 10, and we take away 5? There's 10, and we take away 5, that leaves us how many? Well, that's 5. How about 10, and we're going to take away 6. 10, take away 6, leaves 4. Let me scoot these guys over here. Okay, let's bring our 10 back. Our ten guys, ten cherries. All right. How about ten, and we take away seven? Ten take away seven leaves three. Okay. How about we got our ten here? Ten, and we take away eight. Ten take away eight leaves two. And then ten. Let's take away 9. Let's get really greedy. 10 take away 9 leaves just one lonely cherry. Okay. Alrighty, well that's how we add and subtract numbers. We did a little bit of multiplying just to see how they relate to each other. Just with counting with these simple things. We'll do some more of this next lesson. Meantime, you can check out raisearithmetic.wordpress.com for information on Raise Arithmetic and Homeschool Solutions and Ideas. We'll see you later.